the world's biggest token and coin sale has already started. Imagine that right now, everyone has the opportunity to buy tokens and coins with a 90 discount. What would you do if you found out, for example, that a new iPhone, an apartment, or a car, any item, is 90 cheaper today? Of course, you would buy. So why not look at the market, not from an all-time high perspective, but from the point of entry today? Yes, I have many videos on my channel about top coins and tokens. Recently, I saw in the comments that people have already made profits since then, so I decided to review the list. In this video, I'll share three assets with the least risk. This video is for those who are not willing to take big risks, but still want to invest in crypto. In any case, you should understand that this is not financial advice, and you will analyze and make the decision to purchase any asset on your own. Bitcoin. Naturally, it tops any chart of any video, and that's because it's the foundation that everyone should have. While altcoins may somehow depend on Bitcoin, it doesn't depend on them. It's an asset on its own, and it regulates the market. Fear levels are measured by its prices, Bitcoin is the most well-known cryptocurrency and is considered digital gold. It is the first and largest cryptocurrency by market capitalization. Bitcoin has an established community, substantial institutional support, and is considered relatively stable compared to some other cryptocurrencies. Perhaps you didn't know that Bitcoin has a limited supply of 21 million coins. This means that no more than 21 million Bitcoins can ever be created. This limited supply contributes to a deflationary economic model and may impact price growth in the long term. Furthermore, Bitcoin has gained significant recognition from major financial institutions, corporate giants, and even governments. Some companies have started accepting Bitcoin as a payment method, and some countries are considering the regulation and integration of Bitcoin into their economies. It's an asset that almost everyone has, that almost everyone knows about, and that most people trust. Compared to any other coin, if given a choice, I believe that 99 of people would choose Bitcoin. What about profit? There might not be massive gains, but hitting previous highs and seeing good returns is very possible. Do I believe in Bitcoin's technological future? Not entirely. However, in the medium term, while Ethereum gains momentum, mainstream adoption reaches everyone, and it becomes a good speculative tool to earn you 50 or more on your investment. Just remembered Ethereum. So let's move on to it as the second coin on my list of coins that stand strong and could delight us in the next bull cycle. Ethereum is not just a coin. It's a platform and a whole ecosystem for creating smart contracts and decentralized applications. The ecosystem is filled with decentralized applications, developers, enthusiasts, and enthusiasts, and users who interact with these applications. Considering that it is the first blockchain to introduce smart contracts and enable blockchain applications, it has already gained significant trust. To use an analogy, Ethereum is like the iPhone of the blockchain world. Yes, there are newer blockchains boasting higher performance and faster transactions, but they often fall short in other aspects compared to Ethereum. Few people mention and often forget about its stability, community trust, market capitalization, and ecosystem. The only real criticism it faces is scalability and expensive transactions. But if we overlook these issues and remember that the best minds and developers are working on this blockchain, we may witness something new over the next decade. By the way, if you forgot, last year, Ethereum transitioned from proof of work, POW, to proof of stake, POW, to proof of stake, pours taking the first step towards change. Combining all these elements, creators, developers, project fundamentals, ecosystem, and innovations, this cryptocurrency has the potential to see significant growth. It stands firm and will keep growing even in the face of so-called Ethereum killers. We already have Bitcoin on our list, which might not offer substantial gains, but is reliable for a 50 return on investment. Ethereum, on the other hand, might not be adventurous but it grows steadily, evolves, and is highly technological. Here, one can likely expect significant returns. 
To complete this duo, we need a coin that can combine the best properties of both, the recognition of Bitcoin and the technological advancement of Ethereum. This is about BNB. Before having a biased opinion towards the products of the company that created Binance, it's worth looking at the BNB coin and the Binance Smart Chain blockchain from the perspective of an investor rather than a Binance fan. Let's draw parallels with Bitcoin. In the context of cryptocurrency exchanges, which exchange is the most recognizable, involved in the loudest scandals, and the market leader in all countries and jurisdictions, Binance. Who has the highest liquidity and the largest number of users? Binance. Even grandma downstairs knows about Binance. All this recognition works in favor of the investor. You may not like Bitcoin or Binance, but you cannot go against millions of users as they are the ones creating the market. Now, let's draw parallels with Ethereum. Binance Smart Chain BES Key is also technologically advanced. Yes, there may be some concerns about decentralization, but it is easier to create and launch your own dApp here than on ETH. BESC also has millions of users and a rapidly growing ecosystem. True, much depends on the managing company, its marketing, and its issues. But you can expect higher returns from BESC than from ETH. However, the risks are much higher too. But let's not forget that cryptocurrencies are inherently the riskiest investments. A drop in Binance or Bitcoin will impact the entire crypto market for many years. People see the established system of giants. If trust in any of them wavers or something happens to them, everyone will feel the consequences. Who benefits from this? A big whale or a small hamster? Exactly, no one. So while we're at the bottom, everyone has a chance to create a somewhat stable portfolio that aims for profits, but takes into account the risks. You can find a video about the top altcoins for risk. Takers in the description.